Hello everybody, what's going on? Jerome here along with Choco, and today we have for you guys an awesome back-to-back -back episode of HTM. And Choco, do you want to explain how that's going to work for today and tomorrow's episode? Well, I'm going to go ahead and kill Jerome. <laughs> No, 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 that's not the back-to-back -back part, is it? No, 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 oh, don't it, do this. Wait, are we talking about cuddling? Oh, well, oh, okay, well, we can, we can cuddle, too. But no, we kind of had an idea, because I've only done, I think, five different dungeons in this server, mm. and Choco knows a good sum of them, or different ones that are out there. So we decided to do a back-to-back -back episode, where we have two dungeons per episode, two this one, two next episode, of just different ones I haven't seen yet. We thought it'd be pretty fun, you know what I mean? To just kind of show me around the server, and see some of the things that I never did in the past when I was on How to Minecraft. Because, as you guys know, I've been trying to do things the right way, and just this, I don't know, it just seems like something I should have done a while ago. Yeah, and for those of you who are kind of like keeping track with the technical stuff, uh, this is valid just because of the fact that two we're doing two, but it's one per person involved. So we're we're just in line with the guidelines, and also we have a chance. We still can roll really good um, dodge, shield, and block loot. That's still on the table. It's just the weapons won't be running HF dungeons. So yeah, that's we'll right. See. So the dungeons aren't HF Hellfire dungeons. So pretty much the gear isn't going to be up to the standards that we, you know, like we, we usually use. But I just kind of want it for my own sake. Find all the dungeons and beat them. I just think that's a fun little goal to have. And I, I mean, I think you guys could agree. I think it's pretty cool. And we've done a lot of technical stuff the past few episodes. And I know my viewers are kind of divided about if they want to just see, you know, those awesome dungeon raids or whatever, or, or technical. So I figured I'd divide them up. And uh, here we are. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I mean, it's. I think it'll be good because we still can roll like some pretty decent armor. We can still roll like a block five uh, piece of diamond armor. That's not outside of the realm possibility. So we still can roll really good stuff. It's just that the weapons really take a hit whenever you switch from HF to normal. But um, okay. I think you, I think you can. I think you are still in line for getting some pretty good armor upgrades, still, right? Because you're not uh, maxed out yet, are you? I'm fairly like what what does maxed out mean because I'm pretty um, up there so for what everyone would aim to have is block five dodge five and shield five somewhere in their armor I have only block three shield four that's it yeah I don't so dodge. yeah so you so you you have you have a lot of you so whenever we do these dungeons actually all these loot tables are going to be very important for you because you can actually roll some really good stuff and it's not as risky either so you can do these easily okay um, very cool so which ones have you done uh, so, so far, I've done both pirate ships. Yeah. I did the two that we did last time, which was the graveyard, as well as the... What, what's that one? Is that the mysterious tower? Mysterious library? The mysterious oh. library. The tower is the one... Um, that's the one that's like ice is all around it, the snow one. Oh, okay. Well, I've done a snow mountain one. Here. Um, let's just warp there. I think so. Anyway. Slash warp the tower. Uh, slash warp the tower. I didn't know there was a warp for that. Yeah, I made all these warps. <laughs> I bought Jesus the command. I, I bought the command and I put like 10 warps down. Oh, you're the man. Oh, I have done this one ages ago. Mm -hmm. Okay, so then I did six. So I did this one. I did a frost one as well. And then... Um, yeah, okay, so you've done the ice. Yeah, and then I think... I think there was a... It was weird. I, there was another... Oh, maybe that was the ice one. I don't know. I don't know. I've, do, I've, done, well, I've done a let's, couple of them. Let me warp to the ice one and let's just see whether or not you've done this one before. Sure, sure. What's so, it called? Slash warp. It's ice? called icy depths. No, there's no warp for this yet. I haven't bought them yet. This one's oh, okay. uh, warp. Doing slash warp buys are pretty expensive. I wrote slash tp. Oh, thank you. I got you. No, I haven't done this one. Okay, this one is really scary actually, because this is. I think this is still an HF dungeon. Okay, would you would you want to go in there and try and take it out with me? I'd say you know what. Let's leave this for the final dungeon that we do, because. We can still get upgrades from the easier dungeons, so let's go ahead and leave this for episode two. Oh, okay. That so way we can kind of like dungeon of episode two. Mm -hmm, so we can kit up, and we can at least we'll have a chance of getting really good. What is this? Huh? There's what a quartz slab here. <laughs> Random old quartz slab. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, yeah, but we we can we can get you a little bit more kitted up because ideally, right? You'd want to be able to do these dungeons yourself. I mean, yeah, I don't. Course. I don't even know if I can do this dungeon myself. I I want to get kitted myself a little bit more than this for uh, these things. So let's actually go to the evil mushroom. Ooh, I didn't even know that was a dungeon. Yeah. Well, is there a warp for it? Uh, no. Again, not for this. Whoop. Okay. All right. So we're here then. Look up. <laughs> it, it, they call it a mushroom. This is very blatantly not a mushroom. Hmm. What the heck? That's like a beanstalk. Yeah, it's like a flower beanstalk cup holder. I don't even know. All right, well, let's go into this bad boy. How many dungeons total are there in Hat of Minecraft? 
there are 20 dungeons. Okay, so then it's reasonable if I do a few more of these episodes, I could actually beat all the dungeons. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we still haven't found some of them. Oh, um, there's like really? I think I think to my knowledge, whoop, there are five that are still undiscovered. What? As far as I know. Do we have any hints as to where they are? Mm -mm. I mean, it's possible. Well, we know one thing is that they're within a two thousand by two thousand area. They're not outside of that. So if the if you see like like whenever you look around, the terrain will start like clipping. It'll look like custom terrain stops. When it stops, it, the dungeons can't be out there. It must be in like a ridiculous place or something along those lines. You know what I mean? Like underground, because how has no one found it? Yeah, that's the thing. Some of them are really sneakily hidden. Uh oh, if you want to come help me out, this is yep. getting. I'm getting. Yes. I'm, I'm heading up. I just didn't want to fight. Okay, I killed like everything off except for. Uh, yeah. Okay, gotcha. This isn't a uh, hellfire, right? Mm -mm. Oh, okay. Shouldn't so this be. guy will die soon then. We can do this one, Shoko. In, in we before, got this and before one. I'm wrong, and this actually is. Oh. <laughs> uh, Oh, uh, and you already have block five shield. Like you already have all that, right? Maxed out. Um, you said? No, I'm I'm not max either. Oh, Jesus. Oh, okay. Well, then if we get any gear for it, you you should get the gear for it, just because ah. you helped me out so many times in the past. Well, here's the thing, right? So, my I don't have the max gear, but my gear is still by most standards pretty good. Um, since my oh, I mean, I would assume. <laughs> yeah, no. So I I do have lesser forms of it. So unless it is a top tier thing of gear, in which case, if we do get a top tier of gear, I think we have to seal it for it. Oh, okay. Well, I'm down to CeeLo for it. <laughs> oh, this guy is so dead. Yeah, this this dude's toast. He can't stand. He can't. He can't mess with us. And the non-Hellfire dungeons. I feel like my armor's so good now. Even if they hit me, it only do like a damage or two. Yeah, it's. I mean, the thing is, once you cross that threshold, it's kind of just a tank and spank. So yeah, it it really is not too bad. But HF dungeons, you know, that sharp difficulty curve. Yeah. Well, hey, we beat another dungeon for me, so that's awesome. And let's see what's in the chest. All right. All right. Um, Bad sword. Whoa, what's Void Walker? Oh, no way. What does that do? That's a custom enchant. Okay, so what happens is if you have Void Walker on, there's three tiers of it as far as I know. Um, okay. They have increasing chances. I think it's like 25%, 75%, 100% or something like that. But whenever you would have taken lethal damage, you go invincible, and then you kind of like... You, you, you can't attack or be attacked, and you're invincible, so you can just, like, run away. So it, it prevents you from dying, is what it does. You can't fight during it, but it's pretty cool for that reason. Hmm. Okay. Well, do you so, want here. it, then? Because you, you're you just showing me around, so I think you should take the spoils of war. No, I think I think this is fine if you take it. Um, you might want to also... Well, here, how about this? We'll take, I'll take both, uh, I'll take all of them right now, and at the end of the episode, we'll, we'll lottery pick each. We'll take turns picking one piece of armor, <laughs> deal? All right, that sounds good. All right, well, lottery pick it off. So that was one. Which do you want to do for the second one? I mean, like I said, I, I'm impartial. Even if it's Hellfire or not Hellfire, it doesn't matter to me. I'm just ha happy to do new ones, you know? Just kind of experience all the dungeons well, out there. I think you might have done this before, but let's try the Northern Dwarven Halls. That That's the that's the ice one I was telling you about. Oh, I you've thought. been this one? That I'm almost positive. Let me see real quick. I'm going to TP right, you. Slash TP here, Jerome. Oh, thank <laughs> you. Um... Yes, this is the the door. This is what I thought was the ice one. So I did this one. Okay, so then let's go to the high Aztec temple. Now there is a low Aztec temple. I don't remember where it is for the life of me, but here we go. Okay, very cool. Um, oh, yeah, we're on so, the roof of it. Yeah, we're on the roof. I just did this because I, I think whenever I set the coordinate location for it, I got scared. Silver fish spawn in this thing, and they're really annoying. Are also, there ever, is there any way you could? Uh, this is an HF dungeon, so it uh, should be. Are you? Uh, oh my god! Wanna? Um, I am, I, I'm, I'm okay. I thought okay. I was dying, but I was I gonna say, I'm don't okay. die on me here, buddy. There's, there's a blaze. There's a blaze, and there's also a supercharged creeper somewhere on there. There we go. Oh, silverfish, get out of here. So, are you able to technically coordinate to uh, inside of a dungeon if you don't want to go through the whole entire like thingy? Uh, theoretically possible. Be very, very careful, Jerome. There are there are terrible things in there. Terrible, terrible. Yeah, terrible I can tell. Things. All these silverfish are getting really on my nerves. Yeah, I'm I'm more scared about the the super creepers. They'll one bang you. Really? They're yeah. that even if I have 20 hearts. Yeah, like they will 100% one bang you. Okay, so where's the I think next I area? Have to. You, you have to jump down. Oh, why don't we do that already? There we go. Well, I was really scared about the creeper falling down because there's not really a way to run from them at that point. 
Oh, well, that guy. Oh, well, these these guys aren't buffed mobs. I guess we just ran into a couple that were left over. That's weird. Oh, was this thing converted back to a normal one or something? Yeah, yeah, a whole bunch of them got converted back into non-HF dungeons. Okay. Um, and I think this was one that was put on the chopping block rather early. Oh my god, I thought I wow, had my did worst you just nightmare. Parkour beast, this thing. Yeah, yeah. I thought I had my worst nightmare on that Choco for a second because I've oh, had god. it before where I had a mini zombie as the boss, and it was just, that was before Hellfire, but it was just oh. bad, dude. Like not fun. And yeah, this is definitely not Hellfire. He's hit me a couple times already at the moment. Yeah. yeah, yeah. A, a creeper head. You picked one up, I think, just now. Hey, I did pick it up. Nice. I already, I already have one. Do you need one? Mm -mm. I have I have more than enough. Especially. Whoop. Oh, do you have a Stormbringer sword? See, I never got one of those. So. Yeah, I I had a Stormbringer back when that was a thing. But there's also a command called Smite, which lets oh, okay. you throw lightning down. So. And now wait a second. So it's it's no longer a thing, Stormbringer. It is a thing, but they changed the way it works, so it's not environmental anymore. I don't know if it would make a creeper into a super creeper. Oh, uh, that's sad. Well, the the reason was it was really frustrating because it would hit the user, and it would also light the ground on fire. So, like, if I were to hit someone with a Stormbringer, then there was a chance that it would, uh... <laughs> run, run, run. Why is he still just... Stop it! Stop it! There we go. Ah, oh, no, sorry, that was no, me! No, what have you done? Oh, God, no! Choco! I'm sorry, friend. It's okay, it's okay. Oh my god, all you wanted to do was help, and I hit you into a pit of zombies and skeletons and bad things. Oh man. Oh Jesus. Alright, here we go. I'm killing him off. Killing him softly. No, don't, He's don't, don't dead. bother with the soft part. Alright, he's all dead, Choco. So look at the gear. Oh, we got a ton of weapons, unfortunately. Um, it's not unfortunate. You can still the the three most important stats from most people's perspectives. There's a little bit of debate about it. Yeah, it's not great. It's not bad, but it's not great. All right, so here we go, Choco. Ooh, that iron axe has a lot of enchants on it, though. Yeah, here. Well, you 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 pick first because you brought me here. So I'm assuming you'd want the axe then. I don't know. I didn't get to take a good look at it. Sure, I don't so think this I would. is the axe. Uh, the, let me show you the only like things you'd actually care about. Probably that, that. Ooh. Um, and I'm assuming there's the Void Walker, and the rest is all really bad. Like there's a Knockback Two Sword, Heroic Chestplate, which doesn't even have protection of any kind on it, and no custom. Zealous Chestplate all has his Feather Falling Four, Blast Protection One on a helmet, Protection Two on another helmet, Smite Three on an Iron Sword for plus six damage. And all the good stuff I gave you. So that's pretty much just bad, 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 and good stuff that I gave you. How's your armor durability? Um, it's starting to break down a little bit, but no. we're going to repair it before next episode because we're already done. I think this part part one should be wrapping up in a second once we pick out the uh, the goods here to split. Yeah, you know what? For the time being, you take these. I'll set, up, we'll, I'll set up a chest in my house, and we'll, and we'll put all the loot in there. For yeah, that's the, that's the problem with mine, too. I have too many... Um, Access things of loot right now. Okay, so, so we can add it to the war chest if you want, and then you can just grab and pick if you need, I suppose. But so, okay. yeah, do you know how nightmare works? Uh, no, not a clue. Do you want to experiment? Oh, uh, come, sure. What? Oh, it looks uh, like the server's, server's restarting. restarting anyway. So I guess we'll be <laughs> able to to test out nightmare and all that on the second part of this How to Minecraft episode. So remember, guys, tomorrow we're gonna be doing the same thing, raiding two different dungeons and also splitting the loot again as well. And apparently, we're gonna get a lesson on nightmare dungeons. So take care, everybody. Peace out, and we love you all. All right, bye, guys.